Okay, let's play another game. Sicilian. Uh, here. All standard theory. Uh, now I think I go d6. Wait, do I have the the center fork? I think I do. I think I do. Okay, now we fork. If takes, I take with the pawn. And this is all all standard stuff. I think he should go back to d3 and then take like that. Okay, this is a mistake. Now I just have two bishops. Should I take the pawn? Why not? This one runs into g4, I think. I can play... No, this one doesn't work. Because rook here I cannot push. What if I go e5? e5 and d4. Oh, my rook is undefended. Yeah, I cannot go here because he takes. I'm gonna develop my bishop. He's from North Korea. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm out here playing with Kim Jong Un or whatever his name is. <laughs> um, okay, now I mean E4 just looks looks amazing. E4 goes here, and then I probably push, let's say he goes here and then I push and then I will win this pawn, something like that. You can also take and take and just play E6. This is the safer route, because here I'm just clearly up a pawn with no weaknesses. I don't know. I'm just gonna play it safe. Okay. Now I obviously push. Just go here. I obviously don't want him to double the rooks. He's probably gonna take and then go here or something. Then I have to go here to defend the pawn. And I'm also threatening checkmate and this check to pick up his pawn. So take, take here, queen c3. I see his idea, but what if I go here? So obviously take, he takes, my rook is attacked, if I move he can take here. But what if I just go d4? Wait, d4 just wins a piece. No, because the rook is defended, okay. But if this rook was undefended and then take, take, his rook would be hanging and his bishop. And he will have trouble with back rank. So bishop here probably, then I go e5, bishop here, I go f6 okay our bishop back yeah that also makes sense but what if i go here if take i have back rank mate this pawn is defended now i'm threatening this check if he takes because right now this these three squares are all covered. But his bishop is hanging and if he defends then I just take his pawn. Ok, 
okay now what if I go here or take the pawn so if I go here goes here then I can go f6 he takes my bishop with check I just take this pawn is defended so I think I'm gonna do that let's go here he only has this square and then I go f6 if he moves then back rank I am weakening my king but I think I'm winning a piece here maybe he has some some option to save himself but I don't see it even h6 do I go h6 because this one seems a safer option h6 or f6 which one is better maybe h6 so I just go here he has to defend this square so she goes here back rank he probably has to take and then I take and then maybe h4 okay just take still gonna give this check to collect the pawn what if I just take he takes check goes here boom queen trade look at that check has to go here check and I force the queens off he will have a uh, a pass pawn because he's gonna win this one but I can just make uh, my own passer so <laughs> I almost gave this check so check and here this is probably not the 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 best option by computer but it's the easiest one because now I just get the queens off take take he's gonna go here and then I just force a passer yeah or this one and now I go now I go here and I go here and just push this move doesn't work because my bishop can stop the pawn or even um, the king now I just protect my pawn with the bishop and just bring my rook in so I go here I guess I go here and take this pawn just drop back I mean I can even defend here, here, back, here yep take and go back okay now I can check and I can go here can even check and take go here take and my king is also close enough to stop the pawn so <laughs> why not just have my bishop uh, there is no stalemate bishop takes he at least has this square okay now I just bring my king closer because he doesn't want to resign uh, I will checkmate him with the rook so I'm gonna tuck my bishop away so it's not interfering with with my checkmate go here here uh, back he goes here now I just make a waiting move and boom and that's it and now let's look at the review okay the review is complete 
Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> Wait, 10 moves. Okay, not bad. And as I said, he should have gone back. And this was a mistake. Boom, top moves. Wait, 14 moves. 15. <laughs> no, so now it's the 14th move. Okay, yeah, and this was... Okay, so Rook. So I played 14 moves of theory. Or 14 engine moves, I should say. Because it was about... So it was 11 moves of theory. This was theory. And then this one was obviously the best move. So I played 11 moves of theory. Uh, and then... 3 engine moves. And here I decided... Wait, so let's see. I was... Okay, so E5, yeah. E5 was was obviously winning, uh, so I was calculating knight back, d4, uh, bishop... Wait, why did I calculate bishop here? Let's say bishop here. Yeah, and then, okay. For some reason, when I was calculating, I was calculating bishop f4. Okay. Because if I, if I would see, if I, before when I was calculating, if I saw that the bishop cannot go to f4, I would go e5. But I decided to do the, the safer option and just secure the one pawn advantage. Okay, go here. Blunder. Rook takes, bishop takes, and then probably this one or something. Rook takes, bishop takes, queen c8, okay? If takes, oh, I see it now. Because he cannot, he cannot take because of the back rank. Okay. Takes, yeah, mating too. Okay, but I didn't see that. Take, take. But this was still, still great. Okay. Yep, yep. Okay, so h6 was better than f6, but f6 works as well. h6, take, okay, now I check, force the queens off, push, yep, top move, just want to get a passer, a rook behind the pawn, so he, he doesn't go behind the pawn, push, push, bishop here, okay, yep. Okay, I decided to defend, just so, <laughs> just so I don't get give him anything. Um, okay, here, back, check, yep, okay, and then I take. Because um, that's, that's one thing I'm good at, and openings. Um, the only the only kind of weakness of mine is middle games i think and to improve that i need to i need to do more puzzles okay and then just check it boom uh, let's look at the opening again if he went bishop if he went bishop back uh, then I take, obviously he takes, I play queen, okay, let's see the best move. Okay, so just bishop e6, giving away this pawn. Let's see what happens, bishop takes, okay. Rook here, what if he takes? Rook takes. So here I'm, oh, okay, I'm only down one pawn. Let's say he just takes and takes. Mm. Okay, so a4. What if he holds on to the pawns? Let's say he goes, oh, I guess he cannot. Yeah, okay. So a4 and then, okay. So yeah, that's it for today guys, thanks for watching and see you next time.